one of the most storied venues anywhere in the football world. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Liverpool taking on Chelsea. Thanks, Derek. Well, this should be a decent game today. Both managers will have a game plan. Both teams have a certain style of play, and both sides will want to start quickly. I'm looking forward to this. Might lead to a chance. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander Arnold in the fullback positions. Mohamed Salah plays with Luis Diaz out wide. And leading the line today is Diogo Jota. And Chelsea looking dangerous. Real chance. Well, we always try to be fair about it, but that really should have been 1 0 early on here. Well, what a chance. That would have been a great start for them. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. But a real struggle for both sides on the possession front here. So, Bosloy... Well, Mo Salah knows how to light up any game, I think it's fair to say, Stuart. Well, his pace is going to be key today against a well-drilled defence. He has the ability to break it down with his dynamism. Let's hope he plays well today. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Ryan Grafenberg. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Can he find the angle? Diogo Jota. And a strong tackle. Well, they've given him too much space. Jota. Grafenberg. And that is offside. Taken away from Salah. Madueke. And teammates around him. Oh, did so well to deny him. And deciding to go short with this one. Pressing like that will help the cause. Spot on with that tackle. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. McAllister. And this is Diogo Jota now. Jota. Accepting it intelligently. Conate. Van Dijk with it. Grafenberg. Trent Alexander Arnold. That's a good pass. And quick thinking defensively.
And the flag is up, offside. Well, that's just a lack of awareness. He was clearly in an offside position. And they kick the ball, advantage Chelsea. Gusto. So Bosloy. Raffenberg. This is Salah. Alexis McAllister. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. And space available inside. Jaden Sancho and a tidy challenge. Oh, that's a really good run. And the attack carried promise, but petered out. Fernandez. Sancho now. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And a relatively straightforward save for the keeper. And that brings to an end the first half here at Anfield. Well, he was one of the better players in the first half, but needed to be... Well, they've kicked off the second half here at Anfield. So Bosloy. Grafenberg. Now Mo Salah. Ryan Grafenberg. And he couldn't bend his run and the flag went up. Sancho. Moises Caicedo. What can Chelsea do from this position? A fine reading of the situation. Luis Diaz. Ryan Grafenberg. Enzo Fernandez. Kukureya. And it's a quality pass. Oh, narrowly wide. So unlucky. Alexander Arnold. Alexis McAllister. So Bosloy. Grafenberg. Salah. And possession lost, intercepted. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw in. Alexis McAllister. Well timed tackle. be a Chelsea ball the cross is on a good and fair challenge nice looking move this can they forge ahead oh goodness me off the post well they survived the attack well, that was a great opportunity for Chelsea to take the lead. If they continue to make chances, you sense they'll get their noses in front soon.
rather than a free kick it's advantage Chelsea but he's retrospectively awarded the free kick having let it flow initially and they will make the change now Kukureya. Chelsea will get the throw in. Moises Caicedo. Gusto. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. Never really close to the goal. And it will be a goal kick. Grafenberg. So Bosloy. Diogo Jota. Possession one. Salah. Are well, they going to forge ahead? A vital piece of last ditch defending. Chelsea throw in coming up here. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Chelsea couldn't maintain possession. Alexander Arnold. Now Mo Salah. Counter attacking, very much an option. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Progress made by Chelsea, and at this late stage, a goal could be decisive. So, Bosloy. Well, if Liverpool score now, this place will erupt. The fans have been brilliant today. And Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Substitution time it is here. That's not a bad ball. And the danger is still there. And in the end, no damage done. Chelsea regaining possession here. Well, that's how to outwit your opponent. Can he convert? And the keeper more than equal to the task. Well, what a final few minutes we have here. And the fans are certainly playing their part. But can they take one of these chances that come their way and win this game? Can he find the right pass? Still level, but Chelsea... Can he put them in front? Well, the pass got in the way. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Virgil van Dijk. Ryan Grafenberg. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Pedro Neto. Malo Gusto. Might be a chance here. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. And so the referee brings this match to an end and Liverpool have lost. That's the big story from their angle. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. Well, really no complaints whatsoever about his performance in this game, Stuart. Well, he's the match winner and deservedly so. He was outstanding today. He's great to watch when he's in this sort of form.